Back here with the WPI captains, Eric Ag, Corsovat, Jeff Wong, and Chris Champa. Gentlemen, uh, new season. Jeff, if you could tell us how the first week of practice has gone so far. Yeah, it's been going pretty well. You know, guys been playing real solid, a lot of fitness, but uh, working hard. I like what I see. Uh, Chris, uh, you changed with the coaching staff, Coach Kelly, Coach McPherson, uh, go ahead, coaches, uh, talk about the transition uh, uh, so far in camp. I think it's going real smooth. Uh, they've worked together for a lot of years, and uh, Coach Kelly obviously knows his stuff. I think it's a, a great addition for him to uh, be the co-head coach, so we're just really excited this season. And Eric, to come with it. thank you. Eric, so far, uh, you know, as, as a junior captain, can you talk about the, uh, the, the two guys next to you, Jeff? and Chris, a seniors, uh, returning all conference members. Yeah, uh, working with the senior class this year has been great, especially Chris and uh, Jeff playing for three years now, we're in their third year together, and we, uh, we work well together with the team, and it's good to have a mix of leadership on the team as well. Chris, we go back to the seed tournament and try and defend our title. Uh, WPI's had a lot of success in your three years prior to this. Talk about starting the season, uh, playing some rivalry games right off the bat. Yeah, and they're always a tough game when we play Babson and, and Wheaton and whatnot, but uh, we got a lot of young guys coming in, guys looking forward to playing this season, and uh, I think we have a strong team. Uh, we replaced a couple guys from last year, and uh, I don't think we took too big of a hit, and I think we're ready to go. Jeff, um, obviously a good goalkeeper depends a lot on their bats. Uh, the guys that don't get the stats, talk about the backfield this year and some names that we should look out for. I think we're looking really, really solid this year. You know, Tristan Richardson has been real solid. He was last season for us. And I think he's going to be a big part of the defense this season, too. And Eric, should I talk about the freshmen. How hard have they been working making the transition from high school to college soccer? Yeah, there's been a lot of them definitely taking some hits on the field, getting used to the, the pace of play in college. Uh, we all went through as freshmen, and I know Chris and I took some took some hits freshman year in the preseason and gets us ready for the uh, Worcester City Tournament coming up, so it should be a good uh, opening, uh, opening round of play. Guys, you can talk a little bit about your WPI experience. Chef, all the way from New Jersey, what made you choose WPI? You know, I was looking at engineering schools, and obviously I was looking to play soccer in college too, and WPI, I mean, just that perfect fit of a New England school and great engineering program, and soccer team wasn't half bad too, so just perfect fit a little bit. Chris, talk about your IQP project and, and what you got out of that, where did you do it, and uh, exactly what was it? I did mine on campus with uh, actually a couple of guys from the soccer team. I uh, worked out real well. We worked on an ambulance and uh, reducing noise in, in the ambulance. And, uh, I think it was a great experience. WPI's program is one of the best I've ever been a part of, and uh, I'm really excited for my senior year. And Eric, you get ready to do your IQP this AAC term. Where are you headed, and what do you plan to do? Uh, I don't really know what the project is yet, but we're heading to New Zealand. Uh, the project is up in the air right now. Hey, gentlemen, thank you. Best of luck this year. Thank you.